This video is brought to you by Technically Not a Technician. In today's video we'll be doing a soft modification to our Simpsons Arcade 1UP cabinet. We will be adding two arcade games to our system. We will be adding the original Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtle arcade game and the Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtle game called Turtles in Time. For today's video you'll need a micro CD card, a USB keyboard and mouse, and another computer with an internet connection to add the needed files. The first thing we need to do on our cabinet is open the back of it up, and locate the USB port at the bottom of the controller. Once you've found it simply plug your USB keyboard into the port. You'll also need to locate the SD card port at the top of the controller and insert the SD card with our newly copied games. With the keyboard and SD card inserted, boot the cabinet and once fully booted press and hold the Windows key and the N key at the same time. Next expand the basic settings menu and click on the settings icon. I do want to thank you for watching, and ask that you like and subscribe to the channel. It really helps us grow, and helps our YouTube analytics. We'll now navigate to the storage area, and we'll select our SD card and format it. When I did this I only did the basic format, and I did not format it for internal use. Now let's move over to the computer to place our needed files on the SD card. The two files I needed were called tmnt.apk and turtles.apk. From my understandings these .apk files are for arcade 1UP units. I don't know much about them. I found them both by using Google and searching archives that you can find on the internet. If you read between the lines you'll be able to find your needed files. I hope this helps. We're going to copy the needed files to our micro SD card, you will only need the tmnt.apk and the turtles.apk files, the third is another game I'm going to try for fun. The button layout on the Simpsons cab is wrong for this game, but I want to see if it will load in this controller. With our SD card inserted into our cabinet we'll navigate to our SD card and find the folder named games with our copied files. This process is very easy to do, and this takes very little time. What I like the most about this is it seems to be the least invasive and doesn't change or damage the cabinet in any way. To install the tmnt.apk and turtles.apk we will simply click on them, one at a time, and install the software into the system. You will get a prompt regarding installing unknown software. Simply click OK and continue. Repeat the process for both files. Once you're done simply back out from the Android operating system, and select the Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles. I'm 
I did notice, that my jump and attack buttons, were reversed and that kind of sucks, but other than that, this soft mod works great, and, I'm going to mark this as a win. Hey, Crane! Bring that statue back, you bloated beanbag! 